Somebody scream! Come on! Come on! You know, some people believe that Christians can't make noise and they should only make noise in church. Well, we are in church tonight because we are having church because we want to do our little thing to let people know that crime and violence have no place in St. Kitts and Nevis, but it has no place in the church and it has no place in our hearts. So let me hear you scream! God bless you, God bless you. God bless you. We are winding down to that moment. And right now, we are going to be favored. But before I do that, as we talk about obedience, you know, one of the duties I have is to look after this beautiful facility. And I'm going to ask the cooperation of the two persons who are driving the vehicles, please, please move those vehicles for me right now, please. Park them in the parking lot. I've asked you quite a number of times. I'm going to publicly say it again. Please move those vehicles off of the cricket grounds and put them in the parking lot. Crowd, give me some and give them some encouragement for me, please. Give them some encouragement. Come on, obedience. Show us your children of God. Move those vehicles for me now, please. Thank you. Okay, we go back to the business at hand. Ladies and gentlemen, over the years, one of the best and most popular groups in St. Kitts and Nevis in the region and internationally because they have traveled afar to spread the love of God through their music. And it's our very own from the church up the village. You know the village people like to say they are champs. Well, this is the champion band from the Antioch Baptist Church of the village. The village. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up. Give it up for the Majestics.
Let me hear you scream if you want to hear the Majestics one more. I, I, I bow. I yield.
short break while we get some housekeeping in place. You know why? Next on stage is the men who celebrate in 12 years. They're taking the youth to a new dimension. So we're going to come back. You know, come back in a couple of minutes. Fantastic duo. No, not Batman and Robin. But Pastor Philip Webb and Brother Shelley, they have the new dimension. What's the solution? It's like the day of the rapture. Chaos and confusion. Lord, help the policeman. I take this thing in your hands. For the more we try things to fix it, situation just getting worse. The more we teach them about love, it's heading by just reverse. Leading back to the Bible is the right road of correction. I take them back from old Satan and back to the master's hand. Right 
him and done tell you sorry. But unforgiveness crept in, man and you ain't listening. So you pull out to my chest and go sing. So you got to kiss somebody. But I got Jesus Christ stop you. Like Saul and his dad king. And his forgiveness while we are still here. Wasn't no right to that we child. We mess up long time ago. Still he kept us in his hand. Give the Lord praise. Are you happy? Help the youth, sir. Yes, we have to take the youths to the, a new dimension. God said that he call young because they're strong. And they simply overcome the wicked one. And we know Satan is an original international line destructive mechanism. The Bible said he come to kill, to steal, and to destroy. But Jesus said that I am come that you might have life and have it more abundantly. We have to teach the youth, sir. That Jesus Christ is the answer today and to keep out of bad company because bad company only lead you to PHC, prison, the hospital, or cemetery. And if you don't want to go there, then keep out of gangs and bad company. That's our next selection. Yeah. Come 
of beauty. Tomorrow, catastrophe. Signs of the time is clear to see. I'm taking authority over the enemy. Taking back me family. Forcefully. Now to take a stand, I call him now because you are strong. The work and in hand, putting God in your plan to provide violence in this land. But you have to. Now wait for the hus to take you to church. Because if you wait for the hus to take you to church, 
You're late. late. You're late. And well late. All right. Hebrews 9.27 As it appointed unto man one should die. But after death is a judgment. Now we wait for the hearse to take you to church. Because if you wait for the hearse to take you to church. Listen, I wait for the hearse to take you to church. Because if you wait for the hearse to take you to church. Someone and all evangelism inviting. Going to church, you man is the right thing. So then Jesus Christ is exciting. Do it for yourself. You'll be more than like him. In a church, there's no fussing and fighting. That's a now go bust and no backbiting. One and all, the Holy Ghost is uniting. Black and white, me say dark and light. Wait for years. Thank you to church. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come Distress you. Come to church and God will bless you. Revive and uplift and refresh you, Mr. Satan. He might try to vex you, confuse and abuse and perplex you. Call upon Jesus, he'll come to your rescue. He did it for me and you could be next to him. 